Yes, it's Pythia. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to another tutorial. In this video, we are going to be talking about how to make team only tools. Um, something very simple, so I'll try and keep this quick and easy for you guys. Um, if you're new to my channel, feel free to hit the subscribe button and turn post notifications. Uh, it means so much to me. Um, but yeah, so we're going to get right into this. You're going to actually go into the description, and there is a link down there for you. Um, this is if you want this, or you can just copy the script. Super easy to do. Um, but yeah, so we're going to talk about, yeah, just uh, team only tools. Um, I will show you what I mean by that. So if I hit play right now, I have, I'm in neutral team and I have a sword. Okay. So I have this sword and once I go to red team, it's going to give me a different sword. Let's go to the blue team. It's going to give me another different sword. So that's kind of how it works. It's pretty simple. Um, but of course you can change this however you like. Now, preferably there's a different way I'd, I'd say do this um, just because we want to keep server script service more clean. Um, but yeah, so creating your teams is pretty simple. So just go into here, create your team. Um, I always make sure that you have a neutral team. If you do have other teams, of course, like spectator or something. So I'm going to just mess around here and just show you what I mean. So let's just call this, um, guest. We'll just call this guest. Um, we'll call this <laughs> security. Um, and then we will call this, uh, admins, whatever, whatever works. Um, and in here I have a few folders. Preferably, I recommend that you actually do these for so uh, into like server storage or replicated storage. Um, but just for this tutorial, we're doing it in server script service just because. Um, but yeah, when it comes to tools and stuff, you want to keep it in there. But yeah, so as you can tell, I have the different names here. So we're actually going to name these, you know, back to what I wanted to do. So we'll do guest. Um, we're going to do uh, security and then we will do admins. Now, um, how this script is made is pretty simple, but when it comes real quickly, when we talk about getting gears and stuff, you're just going to grab your gear and just put it in these folders. Um, whatever team you want for whatever reason, um, just put them in here. You could technically put them into the teams themselves. Um, if I'm right, I'm pretty sure they might even have done that where you can just put them inside the team. I don't know though. Um, but yeah, so in here, it's a simple script. Uh, you can just see that we have an update team tools. Uh, we'll clear all the children. So when we get their uh, new team, we'll just clear everything from their backpack. And then we're going to go to the team tools and clone the parent to their player backpack. Um, we could do starter gear so they don't lose it, but we don't want to do that because we want to just make sure they're only having certain teams per, uh, uh, certain tools per team. But pretty simple enough. When the character gets added, we're going to do that function. And then, of course, when their team gets changed, we're going to get that property change signal. And we're going to do this function right here. So this whole function is what's giving them the teams. This function is going to be what's uh, controlling, like uh, ch checking that they are joining the game or they're changing teams. Um, now the tools are right here. So like I said, pretty simple. Um, you're gonna call this, uh, we're gonna go guest, uh, we'll go security, and then we will go admins. And like I said, as easy as it is, you just go right here and you'll go and guest. Now we gotta make sure though, this is sword two. So it's, I would be sword two instead um security we would go into security and that would be sword three and then admins is sword so we're good and you just name that admins now if you want to add more to these tools um they, they have more tools you'll just put a comma and then you'll literally just put copy and paste and it's just gonna be simple as that um so super pretty easy to do um and of course if you want to make another team you just copy and paste and then you just change this to a different thing um, but yeah, so simple as that you guys, it's actually, that's pretty much it. Just a very simple script. This will be in the description if you want it, or you can simply just copy and paste this, uh, down on your screen right now. Um, and then I actually, there's a little team changer script if you do want something like that to change teams. But, um, yeah, you guys, so that's pretty much it. I will see you in the next video. Nothing too crazy. Um, yeah, thank you guys. Bye-bye.